I am calling it off. This night is finished. I'm calling it off. Let's get our stuff replenished. You can do what you want to do. I'm going to sit here and call it off. Well, for my part, I will slay myself a dragon. And for my part, I will burn away the sadness. I will burn away the sadness with fame and reputation. Calling it off. This night is finished. I'm calling it off. Let's let the day replenish us. Well, I can't do anything. I don't have any cards to bring to the table. That I'm calling it off. So I will stop my turn. I'm calling it off. This night is finished. I'm calling it off. Let's let the sun replenish us. Take a walk and master my crystal powers. Let's call this night off and move on to the day. Look at me now, the way I begun the day. I'm number one now because I'm the one who came to play I'm a mess in forces I'm bringing power to my deck I'm a mess in forces I'm building forces and breathe to breathe down his neck so he'll turn and Look at me now. Look at me now. I've begun a brand new day. I got three new cards and now I'm doing great. I'm the number one hero. Because of all my fame, I beat some ruins. All right, I think it's a good time to stop and touch base with you all verbally without the monotonous singing. Uh, just so we are on the same page as to how things are going and where things are. And that's, it's important to do that right now because things are, I feel like they're starting to happen kind of fast. At least in terms, if we look at our fame track here, people are really starting to jump up. Uh, you can get a lot stronger in this game with all your helpers than in Mage Knight. And also your spaceships. So it's easier to kill a bunch of guys early on. So things are going to start to jump up. Um... Our two most jumpiest are currently Roadrunner and Lefty the Blue Baby. Probably Lefty more so. Roadrunner, they've both been getting a steady addition of new cards. Now, it's not just the new cards you have, right? It's how, how well they can work together and how you use them, too. So you could get all these great special cards that you don't start with and not have any bread and butter cards to go with it. So I think... I think Roadrunner might be in more danger of that than Lefty because she has to, she gets rid of cards in order to get new cards. She's got a couple cards that do that. And Lefty was just buying cards in, in his white city. What, green city? White city? Why is that? Yeah, it must be the green city. Okay, yeah, green city right there. Oh, sorry, I got a, I'm kind of tired. Um, okay, so what, what else is going on? Well, people are getting, I think everyone's connected to their planet now, so everyone can pick up 
spaceships. Poor Bix Beetleman, he doesn't have any spaceship production at all. Uh, and he's really been the loser all around here. If you take a look, he's got four pieces. Three of them are, four pieces including this guy, three of them are diplomats. Can't do a ton with diplomats, especially this late in the game. Nice thing about diplomats is people can't attack you if you have a diplomat with you, right? People can't attack diplomats uh, unless they have a diplomat. I don't think they can even attack a diplomat then. They can't attack you if you have a diplomat with them, so that's nice. But there's not a lot for his diplomats to do. There's a couple, couple characters left. Brandon and Elaine. I might do a rule where you can use influence on people's characters on your turn to try and win them over to your side. I think that might be kind of fun. You can kind of influence them. I would have to think that out though and think what that would look like. Um, I guess they have their, their things here. And I guess, uh, so that would be how much influence costs. And then maybe if you add their spaceships to that and you have to beat that, that's gonna make for a much different game though. I don't know if I can handle another, um, Another addition like that. Uh, so it definitely changes how people are strategizing and whatnot. And it might make it so people are just paralyzed from moving at all. I don't know. Or they'll just have to move in big groups. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Maybe I, I might as well make that change. That'll be fun. Um, so we're seeing Roadrunner. She's getting pretty strong. She, she got a bunch of new cards and is right here. Lefty the Blue Baby. Strong as well. He's got a stronger bench too. He's got more people working for him that are doing well. It's been like that all day, all game. Smiley's doing fine. Um, she hasn't really been standing out as much as the other two. Uh, Roadrunner and Lefty the Blue Baby. She finally is getting some ships, and once she can build her ship, her fleet up, she'll be doing better. Um, and I think that's about it. Bix has been doing pretty pathetic. He's been failing in a lot of things. Not pathetic, but. One thing Bix has been doing, other people haven't been doing, is he's been filling this out. So he has all these people with him. He just doesn't have a lot of people out and about who can get ships and whatnot. That's where we're at. Let's continue. Oh, we're on the middle of the, we just are on the, we're on the middle of the first turn of the second day. Okay, so Lefty and Roadrunner already went. Um, Smiley's going to be next. We're looking at her back right now. She doesn't feel like looking at us, um, showing us that those beautiful beautiful teeth. Um, and then we'll have Bix and that'll probably end it for the night. I got a great start to my day. Great start. And I did it my own way. I exploited a new rule and went and got someone to join my side. Someone mighty inside. And great start to my day. Great start. I did it my own way. And I would stand with me, I shall be one step closer to victory. Great start. Is anybody out there? I just did my duty, but smiley let me go to be alone again. Oh, I gotta leave you, Astrid. The echo of all my dreams, and I'll be out there. Wherever you would send me. Is anybody out there? I lost my right hand man Now I'm here alone Protecting my dear Selwyn Are you somewhere out there? Oh, my bearded man named Stan I miss you Stan Are you out there? Oh, you dirty fucking traitor. I'm not, I'm not gonna let you go. I'm not gonna let you go. I'm not, I'm not gonna let you go. I'm not gonna let you go. If you will let me, then I'll be up in this Then I'll be your end, cause I'm 
not, I'm not gonna let you go. I'm not gonna let you go. It was a bloody battle, not a pretty battle, and then he died, then he fell. But at what cost? At what cost? Several wounds. Stan was frozen. Wounds. There was fighting. Wounds. There was an ambush. There were mind tricks. People lost cards. The battle ended with wounds. Let me tell you a story about a man named Deems, judge of the people, a fair wise man. Well, let me tell you my, my sad, sad story. Well, I met a woman, and her name was Astrid, and she was lost among the stars. And I got her, I got her, I got her to join my side. She found a home, and then I was cast astray. And that might be where I was today. But this sad story, it has a happy end. Whoa, I got over it, and I'm in the diplomatic corps. Friend to the people, diplomatic corps. Everything is great if you can talk about your problems. Then. Everything is great in the diplomatic corps. Ooh, the diplomatic corps now. Let's go on a diplomatic mission. We might be fighting, but I am a hero. I will charge into the blue abyss and try to make my way. Cause we can talk about our problems And everything will be great In the diplomatic corps Watching it fall to pieces I was ruling the day, then a change was made, and now I'm crumbling. My friends, they're going, joining my enemies, yeah. And I can crush only so much before I've lost. Everything But what they can't take from me is me Yes, they can't take from me my deeds So no matter how they try No matter what rules they change I will fight on and I will win this day Because I will have the star and I will cause their ruin to crumble to dust. <laughs>